five yard gain to start the drive. Second down. And a quick screen to Gibson. Get number two, the ball in space, and here he goes. Xavier Gibson. He's out of bounds at the 10. He is unbelievable. 59 yards. There, DT, 100, oh, 118 before that carry. Now up to 149 on 23 attempts. That's an average of six and a half yards. Middle, UCA will get a big gain. And the ball is loose. SFA on it. For the rest uh, of this ball game. But looking at this replay, if he makes the cut without the horse collar, Gibson may be into the end zone. Look at all the space to the left there. And they were blocking up field as well. And SFA is going to have one run time down. Let's see if they... The yards out for the second time tonight. Wimbley finds Pater. Wimbley using all of his power, all 200 pounds, and all of that willpower on his back to get in the end zone that time, running through defenders to stretch this SFA lead. Tipping that ball up, and Bruce Harmon, a guy that deserves it all, was around the ball there, and they get the turnover. And that is a big Tom turnover right there for the Lumberjacks. The intended target was Clark. On and that is one of those explosive plays that you want to limit if you're on the ACU defensive side. Credit to Jack's offensive line. They had blocked that thing up phenomenally. But look at this throw. Could not have been put into that double coverage better. Better. And couldn't have been thrown to a better receiver, Xavier Gibson. <laughs> Head top low weapon. Way to go up over the defensive back. Perfectly thrown pass by Trey Sell. But all the end of that was receiver Mo Whitman going up and saying, give me that. When it's in the air, it's mine. Puts the Lumberjacks up two scores. Sit back in a quarterback, and SFA will get to 98 points. Robert McGrew getting to pay dirt, DT. You see McGrew on the bounce out that time and easily just walks into the end zone. But Chris, you mentioned it. They might make Sports Center if they're able to top 100. Just, just let their players go out and do their, do their best. And here could be an interception. And now SFA inside the red zone. Chance Hill. Really here, an opportunity to break 90 this evening. And that time Chance Hill tipped the ball and laid out for it. You see D. Duggan on the pressure right there. Oh, it was tipped by 95 for the Lumberjacks.